my father taught me that it's better to be the tail of an elephant than to be the head of an ant. <laughs> you see, being the tail of an elephant, you are much bigger than the head of an ant. Yes, much bigger in terms of size and everything. Even the work that you do. <laughs> it's much more greater. You achieve a lot. Being the tail of an elephant. <laughs> there are certain ministries that you join and you are not a, you are not a leader there. And you are, you are better off. It's not all about owning a pos position. And yet your family is broke. Your children are sick. All that you think of is just holding on to a position. What is that? So you see, you see how poverty can take certain people simply because they greet him, they've given him a, a motorbike. I think these people were even prophetic. They knew that one day this guy is going to <laughs> come into terms with the truth. So prophetically they say, let's buy him something. So simply because of a motorbike, this guy could not make a choice. What do I do? When, because if I do that, I have to surrender my position in the motorbike. <laughs> so I'm telling you the truth. He never decided based on those two things. How people can be exposed to reality and still they cannot make proper decisions. You find yourself in an environment where anything can change at any time based on your choice and then you don't make a choice there is something wrong with you i still would want to bring it back to you how can you be two meters away one meter away from your god and he knows that you're looking for him and he doesn't cry for help he is not talking to you he's not saying i'm here he allows you to be so desperate. You try everything. You try this business. It's, not, it's failing. You move from one conference to another conference. Nothing is working. And yet the God is there present, observing every movement that you do. He is quiet. He's not contributing. He has now become part of your problems. You've been looking for money. Now you're looking for God. <laughs> You've lost your kettle. Instead of that God helping you to recover, he himself needs to be recovered first. And he's there. And you can't make a decision to join the God of Abraham. What's wrong with you? in the Bible, I closed it. I said, no, if I come back, I think maybe I'm dreaming. I opened it again. I saw, ah, what is happening? This guy, what's wrong with certain people that they can be given an opportunity and yet it's so difficult for them to make one concrete decision.